All right, guys, we're going to talk about uh, shock tippet knots uh, that I use in the boat that are super easy, super efficient, and can be tied really quickly when you're in a hurry, which you usually always are on a flat skiff. Um, this is the Slim Beauty knot. So what I'm going to do is I've got uh, basically my tarpon leader, 12 foot, 20 pound Cortland. Um, it's right here, and I've got my shock tippet. So basically what I need to do is I start with the shock tippet and I make a double overhand knot. So I make a loop and I pass the tag end through once, twice, all right? And as I pull slow, that creates a figure eight. I don't know if you can see that right now, but it creates a figure eight knot, all right? That's basically my stop knot for the beginning of the Slim Beauty. So now I take my 20 pound Cortland tapered leader, all right, and what I want to do is I want to double it over about five inches, all right, pinch it off, and I basically have a doubled section of class tippet. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this and I'm going to pass it through each side of the figure eight knot, I'm going to pass it through the back, and I'm going to take it and I'm going to pass it through the other side. And once I get it through here, I'm going to show you exactly what it looks like. All right, that's the, the figure eight and the class tippet. So now the, the knot is seated. If you can see that, the figure eight knot was like this, a concave, and I passed the class tippet through the back side, then around through the other side. So basically, the knot sit like this. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to pull the class tippet through till I have enough, usually about four or five inches. All right, I'm gonna moisten, and I wanna close the stop knot, so I need to cinch down that figure eight. Don't have to pull really hard, just cinch it down. So basically you end up with the stop knot, and the class tippet is through, and it's the stop knot's holding it. Now it's basically just like an improved clinch. So basically what I wanna do is I wanna pinch a loop, I want to wrap this double end class tippet around the shock tippet four times. One, two, three, four. And then I want to wrap it back down three. One, two, Three. So as you can see, it went four up and then three back. And then I want to pass this tag end through that loophole that I pinched off in the beginning. So it goes through there. Once you've practiced this knot, it gets a little easier. So again, just to show you, we have the figure eight knot that we pass the class tippet through, the double class tippet. We cinch the, the, the stop knot down, which you can see, all right? Then we've wrapped the class tippet four wraps up, three wraps back, and now all we're gonna do is moisten. We're gonna pull it back. We gotta pull the standing part and the tag end. All right, I usually like to give it a little slide with my fingers. Tighten up on all ends. Now when you look at it, tighten it again here. Usually like to give it the knee test. We're gonna trim it. Once you get good at this knot, you can tie it in less than a minute. Always leave a little quarter inch. Make sure you don't, you don't uh, cut the class tippet. Mm -hmm. And there you have it, the Slim Beauty. Basically a seven wrap clinch knot with a figure eight stop. Very fast, very easy in the skiff. Takes a little bit of time to tie, but uh, it's a lot easier than the bimini.